Good afternoon, everyone. Um, I am currently in uh, northern Michigan, hoping to find some uh, pretty awesome snakes to have up here, but really just hoping for anything right now. I'm out here walking this uh, nice gravel road. Uh, really nice habitat back here. You can see they've got a bunch of logs and stuff piled up. I'm going to go check, but pretty cool area. I'm um, definitely hoping to see some snakes. Hopefully we can get some lifers while I'm here. Um, that's the that's the goal, but we'll take anything right now. So I'm going to check all these areas and I'll let you know if I see anything. Really nice warm tarp right here. Everything's really warmed up because we've got direct uh, sunlight kind of beating down all the stuff. Pretty cool. Too bad there wasn't anything under this little tarp. Well guys, surprisingly none of those spots turned out. There was like tons of tarps and logs and awesome stuff to flip. But it was all just too wet. We've gotten tons and tons of water, rain uh, this week. So I am heading back now and I think we are going to check out uh, some hognose spots, me and my grandpa. Um, so yeah, we will probably go do that and uh, assuming I don't find anything here, I will see you guys then. We are at our spot and it's looking really nice. We are walking this uh, kind of overgrown parking section over here. And as you can see all out here, you can just see the lake back there. We will be walking the edge. Maybe we'll try to find some northern water snakes, which would be awesome. But uh, for the meantime, we are going to just keep walking this uh, section of habitat here and hopefully pick up some snakes. Our first water snake is getting into the rocks over there. Oh, I'm gonna yeah. try to get in and grab him. Where'd he go? Got him, got him. Shoot, I miss him. Where'd he go, where'd he go? He got into these rocks. Yeah. I had my hand on him for a second. Super cool first snake. Uh, I believe that's my lifer. It might be my lifer northern. I think I've... I think it's my first northern water snake I've seen in Michigan, so pretty cool. It's a pretty big bummer, but we did miss uh, the snake. Hopefully you guys got to see it pretty well. I, yeah, it was really good size. My first water snake in Michigan, and maybe my first northern, I'm not sure. But um, really good habitat we're looking at here, so we are going to keep going. And we might come back and check the spot again uh, in a like a hour or so so pretty cool uh, we are going to get going and we've got a whole bunch of rocks on this other side to go around and all of this up to the pier here so hopefully we can get another water snake Frog here. I'm gonna try to get him. Oh, he in. That's funny. Haven't seen those guys in a while. Pretty we cool. Used, we used to catch them when we were kids in our swamp. Yeah, they're everywhere. Alrighty, guys. My grandpa has found us our snake. I don't know if this was the same one. I think it was smaller. Uh oh, he's going through. It's darker too. Super duper cool. Northern water snake. Yep, just look at this guy. Super cool. Hold on, I'm gonna pause it for a second before, until this truck goes. Cool guys. He's just chilling with his head up there for us. Hey buddy. You're super chill. You don't bite like the southern dudes. Super duper cool. Hey. That was amazing. Good eyes. Hey, buddy. Come here, come here. So, uh, up here in Michigan, we have northern water snakes, and as you can see by his belly, it's a little bit different than what we get down south uh, in Tennessee. Super cool. Really, really strange pattern. I don't even know how to describe it, but super cool snake. Um, really, really cool. Hey, buddy. 
You are so chill. I love you. You, I, you're the best. You know that. You're the best snake I've water snake I've ever caught. <laughs> Super cool. Uh, but anyway, we are going to get this guy uh, let back into his rock. Super cool. We might even get another one of these guys. I don't know if this was the same one from earlier or not. Pretty cool. All right, buddy. You ready to get back? Really great find, Grandpa. Good job. Got him? Yep. All right, let's go. Let him go. Here you go, buddy. Just look at how he goes right down in these rocks. Pretty cool. Yeah, too, didn't it? Yeah, just right down. You can see his tail. There he goes. Super awesome. Hey, boom. Let's go. We got a snake on the board in hand today. Awesome. We're going to keep walking and see if there's anybody else hanging out around this cut. Alright guys, we've got him uh, up in this little puddle up here just uh, to kind of watch him. But look at how these guys swim. It's super cool. I always love watching them just swim in the water. Super cool. They just float up there on top and... Pretty cool. We are gonna have to get this guy back. I'm running out of storage on my GoPro. So uh, we're gonna get this guy back and hopefully, hopefully see another one. The sun's out nice and obviously the snakes are out. So we're going to probably get this guy back. You ready to go back in uh, your lake? All right, let's get him back. All right, this is where he was. So we are just gonna let him uh, go back into his little area. Bye, bud. Thank you for making my arm smell, like, super bad. I real, always love that. Pretty cool. He's hopping up there now. Alright, we're gonna keep going. I'm gonna scrub my arm like crazy, but uh, we found out that my my nice sand spot that we were hoping to look for hog nose uh, is actually gravel. Uh, from the sky, it looks like sand, but that was a mistake on my part. I mean, really nice territory. It looks like maybe it was dug out for something, but um, yeah, I guess we're going to start heading back to the car. We might hit um, a few spots on, on the way back, but um, yeah, pretty disappointing. I was really hoping to uh, hike in some hognose habitat here with sand, but Anyway, we are going to be heading back. Maybe we'll uh, we'll hike across some garter snakes as we're heading back. But all right, guys, we are back at it today. Um, yesterday was real rainy, so we didn't get a chance to go out. But we are out again today. Had a wonderful time uh, a few days ago with those northern water snakes. But we are at a new spot, uh, one we've been to before, but uh, not really the right time of year. So. We are out here walking this uh, brush line right here. Uh, then we're gonna get into some really nice uh, swampier habitat and uh, just really nice sandy habitat. So uh, hopefully we can pick up a few snakes today. Maybe some turtles will be hanging out. Uh, I haven't seen uh, painted turtles in a while so maybe we can come across some of those guys. But uh, anyway, we will keep heading on and uh, you can see a little bit back there all the marshlands and stuff but it'll be hopefully we'll get some uh, good stuff today but I will let you know if we see anything and hopefully this day turns out good it's super beautiful out so we will uh, check in if we get anything all right guys first snake of the day uh, I think this is a butler's garter might be an eastern but uh, first snake of the day little garter nice snake one. Pretty, pretty decent size. Gardner, Gardner, that's a yeah. Size. Yep, he was just right in this bush pile right here. So I'm gonna get him back real quick. Pretty cool. He almost got down that hole, but yeah. uh, I'm just gonna let him back. He's really nice looking, but yeah, I'm pretty sure this is a, a butler's garter, but pretty cool. It looks like he got me a little bit, but we're just gonna let this guy go. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, guys, we just got a tip from some hikers 
that there's a huge snake. How big around did they say? That big around. No, I don't know. If <laughs> yeah, we. They said it's up here somewhere. So we're going to try to get this guy. I have no idea, but it, it might be a Massasauga rattlesnake, which would be awesome. But we are going to hurry up and go see if we can get this guy. Well, guys, sadly, uh, we haven't found this giant snake or so-called giant snake yet. We should have got better directions and maybe have them take us to it. But um, it's a real bummer, man. It could have been it could have been a rattlesnake, could have been a fox snake, or even just a, a rat snake. But either way, it would have been super cool to see. I'm really really bummed that. Yeah, there's more benches up here, but. I have no idea, like, we definitely should have got better directions, but, so we are just going to go back to regular searching and see what we can pick up. Maybe we can get something like a hog nose. Well, it's not our big giant snake, but, whoa, there was a toad hanging out on this cedar tree. He's over on the other side. Yeah, that's funny. Hey, buddy. <laughs> it's funny. Not every day you see a toad hanging out on a tree. Well, we still haven't found that giant snake, but... We are still looking and we've got amazing habitat here so we are going to keep pushing through and hopefully turn up something other than that garter snake look guys if you're gonna go fishing don't just throw your fishing line in the water or somewhere on the shore because animals get caught up in it and it's really really bad for the environment so guys if you're ever fishing or if you see this stuff get rid of it don't just throw it out your boat well guys I am in southern Michigan southeastern Michigan to be exact and I didn't actually get a chance to get out which really stinks we're planning on leaving tonight uh, I really did want to get out but um, we uh, got to see a lot of family and stuff so we didn't have much time to get out and see stuff and also on top of that the weather was it was like in the upper 90s and with rain and stuff so it wasn't ideal herping weather but um, hopefully we'll be able to get up here again um, it might might be have to be next summer but uh, it was really an awesome trip and I'm looking forward to coming back and seeing some more awesome species so thank you guys for watching this video it was super fun uh, if you ever make it up to Michigan uh, go check out the um, Lake Huron, there's some awesome uh, parks and places to go there, and it's a really beautiful lake, as you guys saw in the earlier part of this video. But, uh, thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe to our channel. Um, we really, really appreciate that. And uh, leave us a comment, any questions you might have. Uh, we love to answer those, so just uh, put those down in the comment section. And Oh, and hit that bell also. That also helps. Last thing, you're not going to want to miss um, our next video. It's going to be a little bit different than what I normally do, but it's going to be pretty cool, and I think you guys are going to enjoy it. Um, I've got a lot of people who are looking forward to this, and uh, I'm really expecting great results from it. It's It should be pretty fun. But um, that is going to be a uh, couple days after I posted this video. But anyway, you guys aren't going to want to miss that, so stay tuned uh, and don't miss this for sure. It's going to be awesome. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.